Alrighty, back at it with more wall hack pyramid head. No one with distortion. Which is always welcome. Hello? I see you, bitch. Nope. That didn't work. I didn't get her. She might be better than me. Alright. Where's she running? Ooh. Oh, she held W. Okay, she's smart. Very smart. There we go. She's not able to avoid this, though. I kind of don't want to kick gens, but they are plowing through them. Got hit there. Appreciate that. Oh. Losing two gens doesn't feel too good here, but I'll take it. Somebody run behind Shaq. This does not feel like I'm in good shape. Now, who is this? They're going through gens a lot more quickly than I'm comfortable with, so I might have to tunnel someone out. And I think it is Bella Bash Fool. Is it a sprint burst? Very intentional in running this way. That got her killed. No decisive. No decisive. Dog, that is crazy. He's working on this gen again. Nice sprint burst. I got the hit. I'll kick the gen. Is 
I fucked up a healing skill check here, I think. Ooh, he's gonna run for the save, I think. Dude, that is amazing. I don't know why they decided to get rid of the uh, borrowed time timer for that, but I'll take it, man. That just seems stupid. Well, that was a short game. They were doing so well on the gens, too. I guess that's really important to make a note of. Like, I feel like... Didn't survivors used to have endurance when they came off of, uh, out of cages? I thought they had the basic, like, borrowed time base kit when they came out of cages, like, it was just like a regular hook, but... Shit, that, if they remove that, that's a huge pyramid head buff. Like, GG, but... Dog, that is insane. Just go next. Why say GG? Get better with that ruining others' games.